Friendship is magic sucks. Just kidding! Hmm, I might be getting a little lazy with these. <laughs> Alright, so here's some My Little Pony bootleg is magic ripoffs, which are definitely stealing from Friendship is Magic this time. Because this time we've got those classic Friendship is Magic characters like Pinkie Pie and Applesauce and oh, wait, they were in all of them, weren't they? Never mind. Are you the one that became an acorn princess, you son of a pony bitch? So these are the Fairy Ponies, or the 8PK Heart Fairy Pony. These Fairy Ponies boast about their choking action, so we'll have to try choking on it later. The Fairy Ponies were yet another ripoff you could find at Big Lot. And I paid $8 for these? Damn it, what the hell? I feel like the back of this box should be censored since all it is is a bunch of pony butts. This is one of those packages that says specifically that it was made to be distributed by Big Lot. The 8PK Heart Fairy Ponies were made by Polyfect Toys, which you might remember from the Quick Change system. But you might not because even I had to look that up. But considering those quick change guys were also bootlegs that showed up in big lots, it's not surprising that Polyfict also made their pony bootlegs. So, psh, these pony bootlegs really aren't too bad. It looks like they gave at least a remote shit about how they did the paint application, so they look semi-correct. I'm sure they don't to people who actually know the show and they're gonna whine that I said that. I guess Blue Velvet Pony here was the favorite as it's the only one that got a special polyficked marking on it, by which I mean a crappy sticker that's already falling off. Nice. These fairy pony figurines were obviously made to cash in on the minifigs in the real My Little Pony line, which they do fairly well, but I mean, you can see pretty easily where they cheaped out. There's none with wings, and they only actually made four different molds. So everyone's favorite Applejack cereal looks exactly the same as Acorn Princess. But as long as you don't actually look at your little pony figurines, you'll never notice that. Right, you two? Yeah, you'd never notice that they're both rearing up in the exact same way. And I'm also fairly certain that these cutie marks aren't correct. I mean, unless Pinkie Pie really wants you to let it go, let it go, da 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 let it go. <laughs> But they did get Oatmeal Raisin's Blue Heart Cutie Mark exactly correct, so A+. Plus. Oh, come on, you gave Twilight and Applejack the same mold and the same Cutie Mark? That's extra lazy, guys. I mean, at least it is sort of close to Twilight's, but that is not what Applejack has on her butt. Gooferton and the white one have a flower and a star and I don't know it's probably extremely accurate or something and really again you sons of bitches at least they made the flowers different colors it really got me there also, it looks like the real ponies they ripped off to make these had neck articulation, but they're like, no, nah, that's too much effort, so they glued them on. Nice. Oh no, mating is magic! Though I don't think that'll work too well, because they're probably both female. I don't know, I don't get why they didn't rip off some of the pony molds that were like Pegasuses or unicorns or something. They all just made them regular, which is pretty boring. I can say about these things, though, is at least they aren't made of overly cheap plastic or anything. I mean, they've got some bendability to them and they feel rather nice. And they're probably pretty comparable to real mini pony figs. 
In a lot of ways, these are pretty decent little pony figures. I guess one of the main problems is, though, they couldn't be bothered to make eight actual different pony molds and only made four. I'm not quite sure either why they didn't just give them cutie marks that sort of look like the ones that they're ripping off because, I mean, they gave them the exact same color scheme and they look exactly like My Little Pony ripoffs. I don't think like giving Pinkie Pie a snowflake is gonna cover your ass or hers. And the laziness didn't need to go to these extremes. I mean, come on guys, you can give her an apple or even a peach. I mean, Peachy Pie at least deserves a peach on her ass. Do they ever um, ride each other in the show? I, I hope that's something that happens. <laughs> The ponies are all made out of solid rubbery plastic, which feels very sturdy, and the paint detailing is very close to real MLP stuff, but laziness reared its ugly head when they just glued down the neck joints, which would have at least given them one point of articulation. Seven. These are just ripping off mini pony figs and then doubling their four molds to make the eight characters was being more cheap than creative. There's no unicorn or pegasus type ponies, even though some of the characters they're ripping off should have been some of those. The most creative thing was their random beauty marks, which seemed to show little to no thought and got repeated one. Pretty standard pony ripoffs here, zero. The package is really plain and mostly just clear plastic with some cardboard inserts to add pink and butterflies, ooh. The logo is also extremely generic, but at least we got butt windows for all the ponies on the back. These have also been re-released under a different line at Big Lots called Playzone, which is $3 cheaper, damn it but it does cut out two ponies. These are, I guess, some of the same knockoff pony characters, but they do actually have different molds than the ones I got in this set. However, the package is still rather plain, too. For cheapy minifigs, these would work decent with the real ones, like for background ponies or something, you know? Those ponies, yet yeah, they invite to parties, but don't really talk to seven. And the bootleg zones overall is five! These are straight up average MLP knockoffs. They look pretty decent, but if they were a little less lazy, they'd be worth their stupid price a bit more. <laughs> We now return to Fairy Pony. Friendship is eh, all right. Hey, uh, blue hair, yellow pony. I just want you to know that even though you stole my pose, I'm really moderately kind of fond of our friendship. Oh, who are you again? Oh, screw you. Well, this is going to bother me for five minutes. Applejack, you stole my beauty mark. I am the Twilight. I am the Acorn Princess. How dare you steal... Wait, even I don't have the right cutie mark. It's just supposed to be stars. I want that stupid half moon on my butt. Fuck, what do I do? Oh no. I should have wings too and a horn. This is all wrong. You know what? This friendship is over. Ah. Did I know them? Nah, probably not. I just want you to know, boot like dragon that. Dragon that. Wait, what the hell? 
That's not supposed to be here. Everyone on high party alert. <laughs> what the shit? Ah! <laughs> what am I doing? I'm playing with stupid pony bootlegs and Pokemon ones. <laughs> ah!